Yo, what's poppin'? Let's get into some mirror strats today. These are some easy setups, best for ranked. I don't play comp once again. These are mostly for ranked and they work very well in ranked. So let's start by run it and bank. I'm just gonna fast forward through the actual setup and then explain how you should play the setup specifically. Let's do this. All right, so first setup is quite simple. This is just a standard bank setup that you need to know anytime you're playing Mira. So this is the first one. You wanna reinforce this one, put your Mira right here. This thing is super powerful as long as you guys keep garage control. If they take garage control, then you're a little bit screwed. But most of the time, the teams like to attack from the server side, and this is a great way to prevent that. You have a great line of sight into the server room and uh, easy pre-fire here. Plus you wanna put it over here because if you put something over on this side, once they get this hatch, you're exposed entirely, while this one, not so much. The only way they could get you is from the garage area. So I don't know how many times I could tell you that I've just gone over here and C4 would someone while they're planting the bomb and gotten a kill, but it's very high. And I like to pair this one with the smoke setup that we did here. If you haven't checked out that one, check out the smoke advanced guide. We had a nice setup in here and this works really well together. These two, if you guys have a duo, uh, play those both together. Now, as for this one, this is just kind of a rare one that you probably won't use that much. This is kind of a backup plan if that one doesn't work or your teammate can hold this one if they want to or something along that line. But if this gets flushed out or they start pushing garage, main stairs, elevator, whatever vault area, this is probably the best mirror for you because you can control, uh, of course, the main stairs from this one. You can actually hug this wall and be able to see the elevator and have a quick peek there. And you also can see the garage just by pre-firing over. You can pre-fire it just as you would in the other objective. So this is a easy first strategy for you guys to try out on bank. So this setup definitely has a longer setup time as you guys see so you're gonna need some more help with that like you need your teammates to be able to make the rotational here um you also are gonna need some help just by having your teammates reinforce some things for you you could also reinforce this one as well i'll show you why in a second but we have two really close angles here we don't so much this is the one that we're going to be pre-firing off if they try to enter through stock it's pretty make, much makes stock impenetrable you can't really get into it as long as this mirror stays strong plus this stays open and then this is actually protected by this little wall right here so as long as someone's not at the top of the stairs they can't wall bang you through this so that's my theory behind that and usually people are going to push from this stock room and they're also going to push from the big wall over here which is just right there they usually enter here here and then try to push this logistics janitor room so this gives us a line of sight all the way deep into the corner back here this also gives us access to pre-fire here while we also have stock control so this is super duper good for a mirror strat now if you guys want to reinforce this you can but i like to keep it in case someone is on the stairs it's easier to get like a full angle on the stairs from this way right here so that's my preference but if someone does rush up spiral stairs they could easily just wall bang you that's why we have this reinforced and we could also have this reinforced so we could have the door barricaded plus this reinforced and then you have your own little safe space here right and you won't have really any threat besides someone rushing straight through your site because this window is protected of course by this wall so it's a pretty um strong strat especially with 
any teammates doing anything. If you have a teammate holding this uh, office area, then you're really golden. All right, for this one, this is pretty self-explanatory. You've probably seen this before, but this is a great Mira. Um, this is just a basic, simple one, and it also is a great crossfire between the other Mira uh, just by being able to see this entire area, right? deep into piano deeper than you can see on the other mirror so great crossfire here i want to personally play this one as the mirror i would have like a maestro or a jaeger or something play this and then also create this rotation hole for them where they could come and sit here and get some angles as long as someone's not under them but they should be able to uh, get some pretty good angles just by shooting through this actual little thing right here you get a pretty deep angle into this so this is an easy rotation from here and then back up to the mirror. It's a pretty nice spot for anyone. Now, some people like to play a mirror right here. I don't like that because you need someone to literally be just watching this window somehow. Like, I don't know. It just doesn't make much sense to me to have it. So someone could pop the mirror just by rappling on the window. So I don't really like that. But this one is one that's very well known as well. You just need to open up pretty much everything and you'll have angles to pretty much everything other than piano. So this is great if you pair this with someone sitting in this corner. If they put a shield like right here, it would work pretty well because you'd be protected from the new balk and you'd also be protected from this area. But this person could protect your rush from white as well as white stairs, which is something you need whenever you're sitting in this mirror spot. But if that, those are controlled, this is the common plant. You have easy access to that as long as you shoot open the bar plus you have access to all these other things that you could pre-fire so this one i don't know this might be the most powerful mirror in the entire game All right, so this mirror strat is actually best. You could do this without, but I love to do this with my smoke strategy on organ. Go check that out if you haven't already. But in short, it's just a shield here, smoke here. The details of that would be in um, that video specifically, but that's just the general gist of it. If you want to master that, I would check out that video though. But we have a double mirror looking into construction slash blue bunker area. And these are so deadly pairing them together as long as you have a Kaid here breaking this. And better yet, if you have a teammate that just plays up top and make sure that this hatch does not break, that they have to basically make sure with their life that this never breaks. There's a lot of ways they could do it. They could go all the way up an attic and play up there. They could do much. But if this stays untouched, you basically win the round because this is the main point in ranked if they can't push blue they don't know how to act is what i've learned through ranked especially in anything under i would say you know champ diamond plat one maybe but low plats gold silvers etc if they can't just push the easiest way then they're not going to be able to do anything so they're going to come here and they're going to try to beat you in every single way they're going to throw nades so you need the jaegers here they're going to throw smoke grenades just to try to run past but they're going to throw those and then they're going to run here and see that your smoke's here and the smoke should blast them now once they do get past your smoke instead of what they normally do they usually run in here and then barricade this up instead the smoke will come here rotate here and play this so 
these guys are going to be pretty much in a pickle they're not going to be able to run this way they're not going to be able to go through this way because because if they do all you have to do is just come here throw the c4 and get free kills that was a pretty trashy c4 throw but you get the point just um get that c4 going but uh we do have to save some reinforcements for this to work perfectly because the way that they're most likely going to adjust their push is through coming through the backstage stairs so the way that i like to cover that once they do that because you'll see them run out and you'll know that they're going to rotate out you still have to get this coverage here but you can rotate back here and have access to the stairs from a deeper angle or better yet you can come over here and have access this way plus your teammate should be playing on the pillar watching the whole kitchen area as well the freezer so that should be a deadly setup as for if they end up pushing this way now this is your biggest threat is if they push this way but you could always just flip the mirrors around if that makes sense um obviously you don't have a mirror on this which is a common setup as well as usually having a mirror here but you could also just start flipping the mirrors so you could open up mirrors um and flip them so by doing this you can get access to being able to see more of um areas deeper areas obviously you don't get the same mirror effect but you can check for the cross additionally you could start opening up this wall to get deeper angles even into it even deeper and see into the a site all the way from the blue bunker so this one's pretty complex and you do need a smoke and you do need teammates to at least have some sort of brain cells they need we need a, at least a wamai we need a jaeger we need um a kaid as well if you don't have kaid you can't really play this one if the team is at all smart they'll just break this open and shoot open this mira and the whole strategy is screwed so if you don't have a kaid i would move this mira right here and just play it on these stairs so same pretty much effect and it should still work pretty good All right, so as you guys see, we're moved on to theme park. I never do anything on theme park, but this is a good one that I've been using for probably since theme park came out. Pretty simple one, but very, very effective because what you're doing here is just making the attackers feel so uncomfortable because you are kind of forcing them to have to push from the backside, which is a very uncomfortable thing to push from as uh, there's a lot of angles that they have to clear, a lot of areas they have to clear from back there. So you're kind of blocking off this whole area you're blocking off the control room by uh, having one mirror here, right? Easily catch anyone trying to drop down or anything like that. Plus get anyone trying to push through here because they feel uncomfortable on this side. So you're basically blocking off the entire east side of the map. The only thing with this is you're going to probably want to bring a castle, surprisingly. So my recommendation would be, of course, to castle this off just to make this more accessible to run through. You're going to want to be able to have some accessibility through site. I'd also even castle off this and maybe even control room as well just to try to block off as much as you can because you're not trying to get ran into like if someone just were to rush through here and come over here boom you're dead um same thing with this guy that would be very bad so a castle could be very powerful or just a teammate that could watch your back there another thing with this is you're also going on a um it's not so important on other ones but you're going to want to come back here and shotgun the surrounding edges usually it doesn't matter but in this scenario it gives you more visibility on this side which you need to be able to slip through here and see this little cross um which basically covers the top of dragon stairs and this window right here that a lot of people like to enter through so these people are going to come in and realize very quickly that if they come this way well that is a lot of um 
uncomfortable scenarios coming there. So if they peek this, you easily just pre-fire them. They come over here because they feel uncomfortable. Whoops, there's a mirror there. You can't pu push here either. Then they have to go reset their entire team and go all the way across the map as long as they, you guys don't make any stupid mistakes. So this is a easy W. All these mirror strats are straight Ws. 